Let's take a little discussion time and uh, let's talk about upgradability and let's talk about scaling and the future and future proofness, which is a term that I've coined for myself, which is uh, how upgradable is your computer? Uh, if you're moving down the line, there's a lot of people out there that, you know, I tell people to buy your system, build it you know, at the moment and buy everything at the same time. But not everyone can do that. Sometimes you need to just go upgrading slowly over time. And this motherboard has a lot of features that are gonna be uh, very useful for someone who's going that route. Uh, let's say that you have, let's do an example here. Let's say that you have a Core 2 Duo E65 something. One of those just kind of run of the mill. Core 2 Duos, you have two gigs of 800 megahertz RAM and you have a, a decent video card. Now, let's say you wanna go up. Let's say you need to get a PCI Express 2.0 because you wanna get a video, video card. You want to be able to run faster processors in the future but you're not quite ready and you probably want to be able to run DDR3 in the future but you're not quite ready now. Uh, DDR3 does still cost like six times more than regular RAM. DDR2 is at the lowest prices that it's ever been at. I mean it's dirt cheap. They're giving it away almost. Uh, it's going to be the point where soon they're going to pay you and you're going to have to get some. So it's gotten um, really cheap to buy DDR2, but you know you want to have PCI Express 2.0, you want to have 1600 megahertz front side bus support, you want to have all this ability for the future. That's what I call future-proof. This is a future-proof board, and let's take a look at this board in particular. This is the Asus P5QC. So, you might gonna ask, what's special about this board? Well, first of all, it's a P45 chipset, so obviously 1600 megahertz front side bus support. It does have a PCI Express 2.0 slot, and uh, it does have the uh, IC10HR Southbridge chipset, which uh, does all the RAID and stuff. So it's got all the stuff that all the P45s have. Uh, on top of that, it's an ASUS board, so you know it's got a bunch of extra features, AI fan and AI expert and all that stuff that they, they come, that comes with every ASUS motherboard, but what really makes this one different, what sets it apart from the competition, see if you can take a look at this. See if you guys out there can count how many DIMMs this thing has. You see how many DIMMs it has? One, two, three, four, five, six. That's right, it has six DIMMs. And do you know why it has six DIMMs? It's not for like some ridiculous amount of RAM. It's because half, uh, two of those DIMMs, the black ones actually, are for DDR2. The rest of them are for DDR3. So think about it, that's pretty useful. If you wanna upgrade a DDR3 down the road, but you have DDR2 now and you're not ready to pay for it, you know, that's pretty useful. You can use that uh, to your advantage to make a system that works. So. Let's talk about the system in general. Let me go over some of the stuff uh, on the board. Uh, obviously, this is socket 775, uh, 45 nm ready, quad core ready. So if you have a Wolfdale or a York field, it will go on here already. If you have a slower core to do it, it will still go on here. 45 chipset does support up to 1600 megahertz front side bus, uh, you know, and also the six DIMMs, which are very nicely colored over here, will support DDR2, uh, which is going to be up to 1066, which is you know faster than 800 megahertz. It's the overclock, and the DDR3 up to 13. 1333. Plus, if you overclock this stuff, you can get the DDR2 up to 1333 in the BIOS, and you can get DDR3 up to 2000 megahertz in the BIOS. So that's pretty cool. If you look at the slots, the blue one there obviously is your PCI Express 2.0. And uh, if you move down, you have two PCIs, uh, X1, PCI Express X1s, and then you have two PCIs. So you're very feature laden. You can put a lot of peripherals on here, a lot of extras, fiber cards, sound cards, whatever. You can do it all. Uh, moving over here to this side, you got six SATA connections right there. So those are the ones that are connected to the North Bridge. Those are going to do 0, 1, 5, and 10 for your RAID. These two down here are connected to a separate controller. Uh, this is what uh, Asus has uh, coined Drive Expert, which is going to help you do two uh, RAID 0 and RAID 1. Uh, so pretty much those are for your redundancy, for your backup, and it comes with software to automatically back up all your stuff onto here. As you can see down here on the bottom, you have a bunch of connection. USB 2.0 headers, Firewire headers, uh, floppy disk drive, IDE, uh, ID is actually over here. You got a bunch of stuff right there on board. So you got a lot of really nice features on here, and not only that, the board is very high end. It's not uh, at all a flimsy board. It has really, really cool passive heat sinks. Uh, I, I can't even tell you describe how they look. I don't know if you can see them. It looks like the Sydney Opera House right there. They're very cool. Uh, they're very efficient too. Obviously silent. There's no fans. You got ferrite core chokes. You got solid state capacitors. All high end hardware on the board. Also, the, the PCB is black. If printed, it's very nice, very elegant. Uh, let's go over now uh, what's on the side of this board or on the back I should say. Starting off at the top, your PS2s for your legacy keyboard and mouse. Uh, then you got two USB 2.0s over here and another two over here. Your SP diff coax is in the middle. This is a Firewire port. Gigabit Ethernet. 
two more USB 2.0s for a, a total of six on the back of the board and another six are available inside the board for your, you know, the front of your case or anywhere else, any extensions you want. And then this is your 7.1 high def audio which is on board and worked very very well I might add it has actually a feature that Aces it's an Aces exclusive where uh, if you have a mic it'll kind of listen to the background noise it's kind of like Bose, uh, Bose noise canceling headphones and it will you know cancel that sound out so you don't actually hear it now on top of all these features that you just saw uh, of course it's an Asus product you're gonna get all the other features that Asus products have so if you don't know about them uh, there's probably like 20 of them but the few that I like uh, well I like all of them but the ones that I really like Expressgate Expressgate lets you boot into your internet your uh, movies your Skype your instant messenger your email in five seconds it runs in a little Linux operating system that's on the board and it'll boot up into it five seconds without turning on your all your processors and hard drives and video cards It'll just go straight to it. You can surf the web. You can answer emails. You can do Skype phone calls. You can do all this kind of stuff uh, within five seconds of turning the computer on. That's called ExpressGate. It's got Fan Expert, which is going to help control all the fans in the case, monitor your temperatures, do all that great stuff. You know, quiet them down when you're not using them. Crank them up to max when things start heating up. That's really cool. Uh, I'll tell you what else. If you're a high-end overclocker, I've talked about P45 being fantastic for overclocking. This one has a lot of really nice uh, overclocking features too. Uh, for the North Bridge, uh, your North Bridge voltage, uh, what else? The terminal front side bus voltage, uh, the CPU PLL voltage, uh, DRAM voltage, so your, your memory voltage, all of that is adjustable in 0 .02 steps. So 0 0.02 voltage steps. So that's gonna help you, you know, when you're already, you know, 0.1 here, and you need to go a little bit more, it's gonna help you get to that bleeding edge of overclocking. Let me also show you what comes in the package. You get a lot of cool stuff. Very nice input output plate. Like I said, I like the ones that have the little foam in the back, keeps things quiet. Very nice input output plate. You get the Q connectors. You need these, these are very, very useful. IDE and floppy disk drives, whatever. And lots and lots of SATA cables. People buy OEM hard drives and they don't get a SATA cable and they have no idea how to, where to go get a SATA cable. This is where you get them. When you build the computer, the motherboard it comes with all the SATA cables you need. And then also on the back, very nice, you have FireWire. More and more FireWire connections. Is that both FireWire? Yep, those are, oh, eSATA and FireWire. So very nice to have both of those on the back for your external hard drives if you're a video editor or if you have really nice external hard drives out of eSATA, this is gonna do three gigabit per second. And the last thing I have is uh, four pin Molex to SATA connectors. So in case, again, future proof, all this, uh, you know, you're upgrading slowly over time. This is gonna be the basis of a really nice system. You can use your old parts, get a new case, new power supply, new motherboard, use your old RAM, your old processor, your old video card, and then slowly upgrade. PCI Express 2.0 video card. Nice processor with a fast front side bus speed, you know, high end. Uh, DDR3 RAM when it becomes cheaper. So these are all nice features. And again, if you didn't have that, you know, that power connection inside of your, uh, you know, your old case or your old power supply, you can use this to run the newer SATA hard drives. Uh, so again, all in all, a great, great board if you're going to be uh, upgrading slowly over time. If you have any questions on this, do not hesitate. Email me, I will answer them. If you can try to go on Google and you know, find the answer first, go for it. If not, email me, I will answer you guys. Awesome board, really look into this. If you need something quiet, future proof, etc. cetera, uh, answer me questions here and I will uh, see you guys next time. For more information on the ASUS P5QC Intel Socket 775 motherboard, go to CompUSA.com and type in A455-2834 into the search box. Or you can call us 24 hours a day, 7 days a week at 1-800-COMP-USA.